Hello everyone and welcome to this UKTA podcast. Thank you for tuning in. Today I'm joined with Henry. How are you doing? I'm doing amazing. How are you doing, Charlie? I'm very well, thank you. I'm very well. So in today's episode, we're going to be talking about the new features that we are implementing and have implemented with UK Trading Academy. So one of those being the new Discord channel. We're going to be explaining what's involved with that and what you're going to get as a member. One of the other ones as well that we're going to be explaining is the series that we're going to be doing. So one of the series, if you'd like to explain what that is, Henry. Yeah, so we're going to be doing a cryptocurrency series. Uh, we're going to talk about the cryptocurrencies we're investing as well. And also the route from $500 to $5,000 and we can scale it from there. We'll also do another series on PropFem trading, FTMO to be precise. Yeah, for so. sure. Yeah, so Henry is going to be taking control of the crypto side of things with that challenge, let's say. And myself, I'm going to be doing the FTMO series so with that we're going to be basically explaining and documenting the process along the way yep. um, being as open and as genuine as possible because as we all know within the trading space authenticity and being real with yourself is highly important so you know we're going to be allowing you guys to see you know from a to b um, from us getting to a certain point to you know the end goal essentially so we're also going to be talking about the ambassador program which is actually in the discord so should we head over to discord so they can see what we're looking at on yeah, our laptops absolutely brilliant so obviously i'm on my laptop now so transforming to the screen recording so you can see here where we have welcome so this is literally just to say welcome and you know it's going to highlight who's new to the you know community that sort of thing we've got rules in there We've got to have rules in place. We all know that. We can't just go in here and start, um, you know, talking a load of rubbish to each other because at the end of the day, we need to be respectful and have respect for each other because we're all on a similar path, similar journey, and we all want similar things out of this. So we just need to be aware of that and obviously have respect for each other. Like I've said, that's a given. We've got a bonus here. So as you can see, we've got Paul, the CEO of UKTA explaining what this is and what you're going to gain as a bonus when you join the discord channel so fairly self-explanatory you've got henry's volumes the chief financial analyst series volume one to volume four you've got the head trader series um, volumes for myself again four volumes of information you know very valuable strategic yeah. ways that we have found work in terms of trading the market and how we actually put that into practice day in and day out. So you're gonna get all that with that. And we've also got a special bonus. It's a strategy that Paul has come up with, which we've had a look at as well, and it's very, very good. Phenomenal. He's named it the Grim Reaper strategy. Um, I'm not gonna to go too much into detail with that. It's very powerful, but obviously you can gain access to that when you join the Discord server. So going down from there, we've got policies and disclaimers. Again, something we've got to have, as I'm sure you can imagine, um, you know, we're not exactly claiming that we're going to make a million within one week and, you know, there's no risk at all to the downside. We all know with trading there's risk. So we need to do our own due diligence with that, as always, to be honest. And we've also got resources. So we've got a broker that we use in there, 8cap. Uh, we've got Vida. And we've also got another one on the sidelines that we are working with in conjunction with with tick mill so with tick mill we are potentially going to be going in partnership with those guys that's really exciting times and yeah we've got some some really big things coming up with those guys so stay tuned if you are interested in that um, and obviously we can update the server you know when that happens basically henry if you'd like to carry on please yeah so we also have the notice board and right there you can see the announcement so if there's any announcements you're going to get it all there and we also have the promotion section. So if we're promoting anything, we're gonna also have it all in the promotion sector. So another one we look at is the live support. So if you have any issues, whether it's with uh, the broker you're connected with or with the trading or you're not getting a lot, whatever issue you have, you can send it right there in the support and we will support you 24 seven right there to help you. And the next section, we have the media section social media updates so whatever updates you have on social media you're going to get on it there for the podcast section any podcast that we do drop on social media on youtube you can get it there so you can easily just click the link it's going to take you to what is uh, on instagram or youtube or tiktok 
then we have the Facebook posts on the right there. Whatever we post on Facebook, you can get it all in there. And the IG post, the SWOT Instagram post. So if we do post anything, whether it's educational content or trading tips or podcast clips, you're gonna get all of them in the IG post section. As long as we post it on Instagram, you're gonna get it on the IG post section. So the next one is TikTok. So anything we post on TikTok, you're gonna get it in this section, whether it's videos or podcast clips, you're gonna get it there. And the YouTube videos, all our YouTube videos, daily analysis, you're gonna be getting it right in this section and uh, everything is gonna be there, whether it's uh, trading clips, uh, live trading analysis, or we're talking about uh, brokerage firms and all the rest of them, everything that we post on YouTube, you're gonna get it in this section. So. Can you talk about the general section? Of course, yeah, so moving on. So we've got the lounge. So it's a member's lounge where you can chat to each other, that sort of thing. You can gain ideas from one another. Just basically introduce yourselves to each other because along this journey, trading can be very lonely, as we know. So it's very important to link up with like-minded individuals um, because at the end of the day, one conversation with the right person can really give a flick of, you know, a light bulb in your head or really switch the direction in how, to, in how you actually look at the markets potentially. So that's very, very important. Yeah. Um, and we're going to be active in there as well if you've got any questions. Uh, we've got off-topic, self-explanatory. Again, we want this to be a community where it's not necessarily just about trading. You know, if you go and watch a football match somewhere, I don't know if you want to talk about football, or whatever the case may be that's just going to go in there or even something to do with i don't know henry help me out here <laughs> yeah maybe you, you like to work out or yeah anything like that yeah whatever exactly exactly yeah. thank you <laughs> um and then reviews obviously you know if you've got any reviews which i'm sure you'll have positive reviews no doubt about that <laughs> hopefully um you can pop them in there um you're more than welcome to be as honest as possible you know at the end of the day we want to improve as well because you guys and girls are really the forefront of this. We're not doing this for ourselves, we're doing this to help people. So if you've got a review, if you've got a suggestion, when it's, you know, even that, that comes down later on, I believe the suggestions, um, you know, even anything in there that you know, can basically improve our um, methods in how we do things, we're, we're up for that. Um, Absolutely. Polls, so this could be anything like, say for example, we've put a trade out in the trade ideas section, we're gonna get to that as well. Say if we've put a trade out, we might say something like, has anyone taken profit yet? Or has anyone actually caught the trade? Just stuff like that. Yeah. Or we might be you know, doing a giveaway of some sort and we might ask, would you guys rather we do this or do that? It's just gonna be basic things like that. Again, just to help you out and to give everyone you know, the most valuable information and uh, product as, as, as we possibly can, basically. Um, so yeah, moving on, if you'd like to carry on, please, Henry. Yeah, in the next section, we have the MBA and courses. So as you can see right there, we have Forex. So on the MBA section right there, we have a master's degree program. So you can read about it, have an understanding of how this can help you level up your, level up your trading game. And the next one, we have our courses. So in the courses section, we have courses that will take you from having zero knowledge about how to trade to becoming an advanced trader. So right here, we have the first one, the Forex Basics, where you will learn how to use brokerage and uh, you will learn the trading basics, creating an income with trading, you understand time frames, you understand the different types of trading, different, different styles of trading, which goes from day trading, intraday, swing trading, scalping, and all the rest of them. Then you will also learn simple profit making systems that you can use in your trading you will learn risk management strategies as well and this is all packed in the basic section and the next one will have the intermediate trader and you so you also learn a whole lot right there so on the intermediate course it's for students who want to take their learning to far higher levels than basic course we offer so this is going to take you probably about two 12 weeks depending on how eager 
you want to learn. If you are someone who's really passionate about learning how to trade, it could take you way less time. But if you're someone who has a full-time job or other engagements, it can take you a little bit longer, probably 12 weeks maximum. So the next one is the Pro Trader. So in the Pro Trader, this is more advanced and uh, it's also going to help you immensely to become a profitable trader as long as you follow the guidelines the step-by-step -step processes in trading one of the things i've understood about trading is you need to follow it step by step you can't jump the process you can't go from basics to advanced you need to go from one step to the next step one two and three so after that the next one we do have right here is suggestions so if you do have anything you want to suggest feel free to drop it right there so in the forex section we have the trade ideas section so any trade that we're taking we're also going to be dropping it in the trade ideas section me and charlie and the entire trading team we're going to be dropping that right there and the trade results so you can see so far we have the trade results right there from november you can see how it's been doing profitably well so the next one we have the trade analysis so what of our analysis that we're looking at whatever trade we're taking we posted all there so you can see so far even the gold trade right here this trade is currently in profit of three percent and also this euro us i think this is a lrz dollar so this australian us dollar trade is also up eight percent as we speak and we also have a whole lot of other trades that we've posted some also ended up being a break even or a small loss like i said i like always say your trades are supposed to end one of four ways it's either a small loss a break even a huge profit or a small profit you never allow your trade to end up being a big loss so everything is already provided to you in the courses and once you go through it step by step you're going to learn how to do this on your own so charlie can you explain to us more about the trading community yeah sure so moving on we can see that we have a spanish chat an english chat a french chat and obviously those are off topic chats whatever you want to put a label on that and then you've got the trading chats below so we are accounting for multilingual you know cultures at the moment spanish and french being the main two that we're doing so and then obviously we've got suggestions in there as well like for example you can see here one of our members can a french community be added a chat be added so we applied that you know it's not hard to do things like that again we want to bring the most valuable things possible to you um so with this that's going to help you do that you know because we're going to see this and we're th going to think right okay we'll do that because it's clearly going to help thousands of people potentially that don't speak english that speak spanish or that don't speak english that speak french or german maybe one day whatever the case may be okay so moving on we can see ambassadors right at the bottom so with the ambassadors this is a great opportunity i will say that if you agree henry it's really yeah, good isn't absolutely. it so how this is going to work is say if you join the discord server and you pay the monthly fee or whether that be you pay the yearly fee to save a bit of money long term if you bring in a person using your link that we will give you you will get 15 percent off your payment so you can imagine if you get multiple people in your price is going to go right down so that really is dependent on you the individual if you want to bring more people in you're more than welcome to because we want to reward you for that you know and yeah like i said it's a very very good opportunity in my opinion if there's anything you want to add on that henry yeah so basically it's been an incredible uh, explanation so far to all our viewers and our members to have an understanding of how you can use the vip trading group and you can see that you can basically suggest things that you want us to add right there and we will add them as well and this is just basically just the beginning because we still have a lot more that we're going to be adding there like the cryptocurrency trading we haven't even added that yet which we're also going to put in there as well and stock investing as well we're going to still add that as we go on so before we wrap up we're going to talk a little about the cryptocurrency that we've already invested in which is a dsla protocol which is doing very nicely today we're up over 30 percent in profit yeah. and also we're going to be sharing with you our members and all our viewers 
the crypto portfolio that we are building as well a road from five hundred dollars to five thousand dollars and from there we can scale it as high as possible and the reason we're doing this from five hundred dollars is because it's something that anybody from anybody anywhere can do so whether you have a full-time job or whether you don't really have a lot of money to invest is something for you to see that you can do this no matter where you are at the point of your life you can do this all you need is to have the right knowledge that will provide right here at uk trading academy so charlie can you tell us a little bit about the series on the ftmo challenger you'll be doing as well yeah sure so similar to henry obviously but with the forex side of things you know, we're going to be opening the curtains and just allowing the eyes to be on us because at the end of the day, if we can't do it, we can't be sat in these chairs teaching you, you know. So we're putting our names on the line, you know, in actually doing this because we're putting our money where our mouth is basically. And with the FTMO evaluation, um, I'm going to be explaining the trades that I do enter on that account on, and the risk as well because with the valuations I've experienced with the systems that I use, sometimes the risk can vary. And there's one specific system that I am going to be using with that evaluation that I'm going to be doing with slightly higher risk than 1%. I might be risking 1.5%, um, to be honest, maximum. But yeah, it's very exciting times. I'm very happy that we're doing this. Yep. because it's accountability at the end of the day. And we've said it in a previous podcast. I'm all about that. Henry's all about that because yep. you know this is our job. This is what we do. And we're excited to share it with you, the viewers and the members potentially as well. So Henry, and this is going to be a value to everyone, I'm sure. Just a bit of a story. Henry shared with me and the members here as well, and the team, in fact, a specific cryptocurrency coin that could possibly do well. There was reasons behind it. That was a few weeks ago, maybe a month yeah. or two ago. Yeah. And today we've seen significant gains on that. So Henry, if you please wouldn't mind explaining a little bit about how you came to that conclusion, what sort of things were you looking at to say, right, okay, it could potentially go there. You know, what was it about that specific project or coin that really sparked your interest, would you say? So the first thing that sparked my interest was the fact that the protocol was focusing on risk management, which I believe that with institutions coming into cryptocurrency, risk management is going to be a very crucial aspect that they will be focusing on. So the next thing I did was to understand the tokenomics. And uh, firstly, I wanted to understand the market cap because it was at 3 million back then. And then the next thing I did was to look at the max supply the total supply and the circulation and supply so the reason why i always look at this is because if a coin has less than 70 percent in circulation very skeptical to invest in it because when the remaining gets deployed into the market it could actually crash the price okay. or in this case it has like i think 98 percent is already in circulation right now so that was another big bonus for me that checked uh, one of my checklists because I have a checklist of things I want to see in an asset before I invest in it. The first one is fundamentals, second one is technicals, and then quantitative analysis. So on the fundamental aspect, I made sure to understand that this has potential for growth and it's actually solving a major problem in the crypto ecosystem, which is risk management. Because everyone wants to manage risks, no one wants to lose all their money. And the next thing I did was to now look at the technical aspects. So I went to the monthly time frame to understand whether we're bullish or bearish. And on the monthly time frame, I was seeing that this has consistently been in an uptrend. So even though it has a huge pullback due to the bear market in 2022, so the bear market dropped price drastically. I think it dropped over 90%. And me personally, when I want to buy into any asset, I like to see that asset red. I like to see <laughs> it literally 90% or more. I don't like to buy when it's going up. I like to buy when it's going down. Even though a lot of people don't really like to invest yeah. in an asset when it's going down. Like I was telling you, people only want to support you when you're doing well. Yeah. So it has to do with even in investing, people only want to support an asset when it's doing well. When it's not doing well, everyone calls it a meme coin. <laughs> so yeah. that was one thing I was looking for to see on the price action. I wanted to make sure that I'm buying at discount. I like to buy at extra discount. And when prices are premium, I start to take profit. But in this case, I'm not really taking profit yet because we've not even started the real pump 
like Correct. I was telling you, the minimum I'm expecting from this asset is 10x, 100x. That is literally minimum. the bare minimum yeah. I'm expecting from it. And also, we did uh, the technical analysis and we saw a monthly shift in market structure as well. After price mitigated, our point of interest filled the inefficiency that is resting at the extreme discount zone. We broke structure on the monthly time frame and then I wanted to see a retest. And the retest came very nicely retested at the extreme level as well. So I started to accumulate a lot of my positions, which I shared with you, shared with the entire team and yeah. all our members as well. And everybody is currently in profit right now. Yeah. And, uh, because the reason we're in profit is because we bought it at the right prices. Because most people buy when it's going up, but I prefer to buy when it's going down at an extreme discount level. That is the reason why we're in profit. And I see, see a lot of people on social media, on their group, like screaming, their portfolio is red and <laughs> lost. And that is because they bought it at the wrong time. So you need to learn how to buy at the right prices. So the next thing I did was to do my quantitative analysis to understand the previous price actions, how high did it go. And when we did that, I think the first one, it did around, uh, I think it was 3,200% to the upside. That was the first impulse leg. And then we saw a higher low. And then the next impulse leg was uh, around almost 20,000 so from quantitative analysis I had to do the maths and it was giving me around 5.9 if I times that by 20 almost 20 percent it's giving me around over a hundred thousand percent so I'm aiming for a best case scenario of around 0 0.3 wow. or more it could yeah. it could go higher but the reason I like to have those numbers on my chart is so I know areas I'm gonna be scaling out my capital investments and I'm gonna be scaling out at least 70 to 90 percent of my profit and i can allow the rest to do whatever it wants to do so those are just my checklist and everything aligned on that asset and that is why we basically invested in it interesting so i noticed at the start you said about the the market cap yeah it was three million that's yeah. correct yeah just to give the viewers an idea that maybe aren't into crypto the comparison and how small that is compared to other cryptos if you wouldn't yeah. mind so, Expanding, please. Uh, for instance, crypto, Bitcoin itself, it's at uh, one trillion, and uh, and if you look at coins like Doge, Sheep, that don't really have any utility, in my opinion. Yeah, they are currently sitting at like ten billion, and we have coins like Dog with Hat, that is currently at like four billion. Yeah. So that is to show you that there are a lot of coins sitting at billion dollar market cap that don't actually do anything. Yeah. Now imagine if you're solving a problem for literally a lot of the cryptocurrencies, you could literally take a huge chunk of that. And that means this coin literally going to a hundred million. It's not really so much mm. compared to what the meme coins are doing. Yeah, correct. Yeah. You know, so as long as the as long as the protocol they do good marketing to make other people see what they're doing and how good it is. And they're also launching a, a version three okay. recently. So I don't really know the dates of that. And they also have an airdrop coming on May 15th. So anyone who owns the coin and also own, they also have this other AI coin they launched this year. So if, if you have the AI coin, even if it's just one token, and then the DCS, DSLA, there's a way to do the math and they will give you more of the AI token. Okay. So it's up to you what you want to do with it, whether you want to hold it or you want to sell it, it's up to you. That's interesting. So that is also could potentially uh, bring a lot of uh, people to look at the coins because people like free stuff. A lot of people like free stuff. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know, so the version three and today, because KuCoin, you, they put a, an ST tag, which means special treatment. Okay on DSLA because they felt like the volume was low. So that actually made a lot of investors to really be very skeptical about investing in it. But uh, the SD tag got removed today. So, and the moment it got removed today, the coin had an explosive pump of, I think it, it pumped like 40%, if I'm not close mistaken. Close to 70, I think. Oh, 70. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so it pumped 70%. Yeah. And then KuCoin actually allotted literally millions of people using that app. They literally allotted them that DSLA is the top three performer for today. So imagine KuCoin has a, a, a over 30 million users 
and every single one of them that has a notification on that app yeah. is going to get a notification on their cell phone this coin is the top mover for today let's say just one percent of them has an interest and they're like i want to put a hundred dollar into this so one percent of 31 million is about three hundred and ten thousand. so yeah. let's say three hundred and ten thousand people have a hundred dollars to put yeah, in yeah. it that's about 30 million that's taking us to 10x <laughs> <laughs> you know so that's why this, the, the road ahead is really, really very promising. And uh, before I invest in any assets, I always ask myself two questions. If it works out, would I be happy with it? If it doesn't work out, will I be okay with the loss? Yeah. And I'm okay with the loss. Yeah, fair and enough. And I'll be very happy if yeah. it works out. So that is how I invest. I don't just blindly invest in coins. I don't invest in coins. People tell me, oh, look at this. This is going to be the next Ethereum. I'm not interested in the next Ethereum. I'm interested in a coin that is solving a major problem. You know, okay. just like the ones I've shown you that is on the watch list, the likes of Ichi and uh, so many of them. There are so many coins, the likes of Quant. Yeah. You know, a lot of them are solving major problems. The problem of interoperability, uh, you know, the problem of um, stability, volatility. These are really key problems. And these are cryptos that could take a huge chunk of the market share. So I believe DSLA has a huge opportunity to dominate the market and the all time high is at 0.02. So and if we should hit the all time high, Bitcoin halving was last sat Saturday. And if we should have a bull run and uh, DSLA should hit the all time high, that's actually going to be phenomenal because yeah. if you bought in at uh, 0.0006, which we give to our members, they were buying from 0.06 just around that price range 0.06 to 0.061 whatever around that range if you were in at those prices and price hits an all-time high that's literally over a 50x yeah return so a thousand dollars you have fifty thousand dollars so where else are you going to get that kind of return on investments correct so even real estate is not going to give you that kind of return yeah you know and even the stock market is going to take you ages to <laughs> actually make that kind of return on the stock market but that's one of the things that I love about crypto. Anything is possible. You're going to see people make millions this, this year, stroke next year, between now to next year. You're going to see people make millions of dollars investing in cryptocurrency, investing with as low as $1,000. Yeah. So it's all about you spotting the opportunity, spending the time right now. The best time to start is now. Mm. The second best time to start it's now. <laughs> <laughs> the best time to start was yesterday. <laughs> yeah, yesterday. The second best time yeah, is yeah. now. <laughs> so instead of just watching this and not doing anything with that information, it's best you get the right education, understand the cryptocurrency market, understand how to invest, what to invest in. Don't just throw money into an asset because you saw someone on Instagram or whatever social media platform telling you this coin is going to be the next 100x coin. How do you know it's going to be the next 100x coin? Yeah. You know, you don't really need people telling you what is going to be the next 100x coin. You need to learn how to do this yourself. And that is one of the knowledge, one of the education we're going to be giving you at UK Trading Academy. You're going to get top notch education. This is not like the regular education you get from any place else where they just tell you, we want this to go to 100x. Why? You know, basically most people don't have anything to back that claim. No. But right here in UK Trading Academy, we're showing you reasons why we believe this has that potential. At the same time, like it's all about taking a risk and we also help you manage that risk because we're not telling you to take your entire portfolio your entire network and um, network and put it on a random crypto coin exactly yeah. you know we're not doing that we literally tell you to use the least amount of money that you know that you can afford to lose exactly and we're looking at it doing an exponential having an exponential growth to the upside that is what we're investing in we're not looking for assets that don't really have much so we're not looking at meme coins. Yeah, meme coins do a 10x, 100x, 1000x. But at the same time, what happens next? They go to zero. Correct, yeah. You know, we're not looking for such assets. We're looking for things that has a long-term vision. Assets that have long-term vision solving major problems in the cryptocurrency ecosystem. Yeah. 
That's amazing. And you know what? It's innovation as well. Absolutely. So, you know, like you just said a minute ago, it's not you're not looking for the next Ethereum because that already exists. Yeah. You're looking for a company, a project, a business, a team that's doing something positive for all that space. Yeah. So it's really interesting that you actually look for that utility. Yeah, that's that's amazing. I mean, like we said as well, it's risk management. One thing that we have control over in this market is how much we risk. Absolutely. You know, and if you're not managing risk, then you're opening yourself up to major loss, you know? Yeah. Not yeah. just financially either. Mentally as well. Yeah, mental capital, going back to that. We spoke about that on a previous podcast. So yeah, thank you for that, Henry. That's really, really valuable information. And you know, like we said, that's given to the members and to the team as well. So we've got people that don't necessarily trade here, but they're gathering information just by being in this environment because we're speaking about it all day, you know, yeah. when we're in the office, that's what we're talking about is trading because it's what we love to do. You know, we enjoy it. And, you know, and it's, it's, an, it's an addiction. It really is, yeah, <laughs> by this point, it's an addiction. And it's just amazing that we can share it with people that are willing to learn as well. Because obviously we were once in that position. No one's just born with the information in their brain. Everyone has to learn somewhere along the journey. And it's amazing to be in a position where we can teach people, you know, the right information. You know, just by being real and being open about it. I've said that before. But it's true. It really is true. So is there anything else that you'd like to talk about in terms of crypto, Henry? Or would you say? Yes. Yeah, so I'm going to be launching the crypto series. Of course. We're yeah. going to be doing the road from 500 to 5,000. And then once we hit 5,000, we're going to scale it from there to see how high it can go. So uh, very soon we're going to be launching that and we'll be sharing it with our viewers and all our members and some of them who are interested, they can also participate to see how this works because a lot of the time people tell you we can do this but there isn't any transparency like yeah. i was showing um christian the other day about someone who was talking about oh today i made seven thousand dollars today i made nine thousand dollars and there's nothing to it's just like seven thousand dollars on his screen yeah just Boom. numbers and yeah. i'm like so how did you make the seven thousand <laughs> yeah. dollars how did you make 9k you're not yeah. show, you're not really showing me anything no you know what made you that money we're going to be showing you what made that money like today i was showing you the little portfolio i started up with a thousand dollars and it's at 7k and today it made two thousand i think two thousand plus today and i literally was doing nothing just chilling at the office and i just showed you yeah it just made two thousand yeah. yeah. i can literally see that you know it's not like me just coming telling you oh my portfolio made two thousand yeah, dollars one yeah. of my portfolio made two thousand dollars yeah you know you you'll be like okay there's you're not showing me the walking yeah. you're just telling me yeah you know so right here in uk trading academy we're going to show all our viewers and members how we do this thing there's going to be transparency like never before right here just to add on to that i'm interested in the risk in terms of how because obviously 500 to 5000 is 10x yep. we know that there's coins out there that can do that overnight yeah how i know we've just started to discuss it today so i'm not sure whether you thought out a proper plan yet you may have already i'm just interested in how you're going to structure that because obviously with trading typically it's one percent risk mm -hmm. but to get that with crypto it's, it's obviously going to be obviously more risk of the portfolio yeah. how would you kind of um, structure that would you say so i now because it's a small amount of money i'm going to be going for low caps okay so because low caps are the ones that has that potential to do like 5x and 10x easily during the bull run and i'm, I'm not going to be investing in bitcoin ethereum in as much as they still have potential to do like probably 3x 5x and all the rest of them but they, i'm not expecting to see a 10x on bitcoin it's possible yeah. but i'm honestly not expecting that if i wanted to expect a 10x i would have put the money in when it was at like 15,000 and then expect a 10x yeah, yeah. and that would be at 150,000 so yeah. that's a huge jump but like things, for example, DSLE, that's an easy 10x. Yeah. You know, if I put it there on DSLE just alone, that's an easy 10x. <laughs> yeah. Or maybe look at things like um, another one, Ichi as well. That's literally going back to an all-time high. I think going back to an all-time high, current price is $2. Going back to all-time high is probably about 70x or 80x or something like that. Okay. So you basically see, we've already surpassed the road to yeah, tennis. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, I'll just uh, split the money a little bit, but I'm not going to split it too much. Uh, probably just two or just one okay. coin. Yeah, yeah. I'm not going to split it so much because if I split it too much, the road to 10x will be hard to 
one thing I've learned, this was basically from Warren Buffett. So one thing I learned from him is something he said, when you diversify too much, it simply means that you don't understand what you're doing. Wow. So you just need to know what you're doing and focus on it. It's just like you being a trader. Why are you not a trader and also an engineer and a plumber and a carpenter and a musician? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that makes because sense. That's diversification. You try to do so many things so you can make sure you're making money from different angles, but you chose to be a trader. Just one thing and you become a master in just one thing. Yeah. You know, like you're not, imagine you met so you had maybe a headache or chest pain and you go to your GP and then your GP is now telling you, giving you investment advice, telling you, yeah, buy this stock. And then after that, your GP tells you, so if you want to fix your sink, this is what you do. And then your GP is now also telling you, yeah, if you want to fix your zinc, I can, I can teach you how to do that. You're like, okay. <laughs> I think I'm going to need another yeah, yeah. GP right now <laughs> because I don't know. I don't really know your profession. It's the same guy. It's just got different uniform on. Yeah, that's the thing because <laughs> you want to meet someone who all they do is this. You know, this is their profession. Yeah. They're a doctor. All they do is to look at your body and tell you what is wrong and help you to get better. The same thing goes to UK Trading Academy. You want to meet people who when you come here, all we do is trading. There's nothing else I do besides Correct. trading. Yeah. Nothing. I used to model, but now I don't. You know? <laughs> and if you call me to model, I'm going to tell you I don't have time because I'm either studying, trading, or helping people that want to learn how to trade. Yeah. That's literally all I do Monday to Sunday. It's funny how life can switch a passion like that, you know, because yeah. we never know what it's going to be like, but everything that's meant to happen will happen. So obviously you've been put on this journey, this path for a reason. Yeah, you know, absolutely. So yeah, that's very interesting. Thank you for that insight. So yeah, that's that's pretty much it. I can say very exciting times. Very very exciting. Yeah. Obviously, you can see as well the podcast is beginning to develop, which we're really happy about. So you know, it's like anything. You've got to start somewhere. You really really have. So we wish to continue this and really grow it into something amazing, which I'm sure it will do. You know, given that we're going to continue on at the rate that we are doing. Yeah. So, is there anything you want to add on to that, Henry? Or? Yeah, so far, we truly appreciate you for always tuning in to all our viewers. We truly appreciate you. And uh, in the next episode, we're still going to be talking more about how we trade and how we invest in the cryptocurrency market and the foreign exchange market as well. We appreciate you. And until next time, we will see you later. Have an amazing day, everyone. Thank you.